Hello again, YouTube friends. This is Shay Shay N5, and this is still the same night that I'm making all these videos on, <coughs> which is Thursday night. I've got the house to myself for a little while. <coughs> Sorry, I can't clear my throat. Mm. And but I'm making videos that I'm gonna be just keeping and waiting for the day to get here to put them up. And I have made several, and this one here is for next. This coming Tuesday. This is Thursday night, so we have Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday, and Tuesday when this is going to go up. Because it's our Tuesdays of the week video. So here we go. I have my trusty notebook here. That's very bright because of the light, and you can't see it, I guess. I hope. I didn't swear my laptop up. Because when I tilt it, it might just be the, the way of that. Anyway. And see there? Well, that was bright. Y'all didn't see. I didn't. I was even thinking it was a blank paper. Or was it? Let me try that again. <laughs> see, I'm crazy. Okay. All right. What is happening? Does my laptop have a sword in it or what? Anyway. <clears throat> I ain't going to worry about it. I'm sorry. I had to clear my throat. Okay. Right here. See? Of the week videos quote of the week and as you can see I've scratched through all of them okay here we are quote of the week number 12 so we have I tried being reasonable I didn't like it <laughs> I like that that's our quote this week I tried being reasonable I didn't like it <laughs> shut up that's Junior. He's bugging me. He wants to go outside, inside, outside, inside, outside, inside. Okay. Alright. So, that quote was quoted by Clint Eastwood. I know who Clint Eastwood is. He's an actor that plays in movies that I have seen and heard about and know about. But I don't care for those type of movies, so I don't watch them. Okay. Now, do y'all know who Clint Eastwood is? And have y'all ever heard that quote? I tried being reasonable. I didn't like it. <laughs> okay, moving on. We have question of the week. Question 12. What candy do you like best out of a box of chocolates. Now what I'm talking about here is you know like it Valentine's time. I don't like that bright light. That bugs me. <laughs> when you get the heart shaped box it's all red and pretty and sometimes they're velvet and you open it up and you have all these little chocolate pieces of candy they're all, they all look chocolate on the outside, but some of them are different types of chocolates. You know, there's a milk chocolate, there's a dark chocolate, and I don't know what all else. But then their insides is all different. I like the ones that is chocolate on the inside. And then I like the ones that is caramel on the inside. I do not like the ones that is white on the inside. I think that's coconut. Ew, I don't buy coconut. And then I don't like the ones that are pink on the inside. That's probably strawberry. Might be watermelon. I don't know. But I don't like them. So it's probably strawberry. Might be cherry. I don't know. I would think I would like it if it was watermelon. But I don't like it. So it's probably not watermelon. It's probably strawberry or cherry. I don't like either one of them. So anyway. And then they, have, they may have other kinds in there. I can't really remember. I just remember the white, the pink chocolate and the caramel. They might have others. Do they have any that's like, that has any kind of peanuts in it or nuts or, or pecans or anything like that? I don't know. I don't remember. But the question is, what candy do you like best out of a box of chocolates? That type of box of chocolates. I like the chocolate ones and the caramel. And some of the, those chocolate ones, the insides may be a dark chocolate, and then some may be a brown or lighter milk chocolate, if that's what they call it, or whatever. I don't know. Anyway, answer your questions down below. 
Comment about the quote down below in the comment box section. Okay. Moving on to opinion of the week. And I don't write good, so y'all don't pay attention to my writing. Alright, number 12 on this one. Your opinion on this. That's cool. <laughs> okay. Should the heart boxes of candy be listed under them what's inside of them or not and why? You know, should there be, because you never know what kind you're getting and you have to pick up and either bite into it to see what it is, or you have to break it in half or smoosh it or something to see what the middle looks like to see if you're going to like it and want to eat it or not, right? That's how I do. So, in your opinion, is it fun to be surprised, secreted, and mystery that way and not know what kind you're getting? Or do you think they should put the names under the candy and write what kind of candy it is on the inside so you could know which ones to get and eat? that you would like and leave the ones alone that you don't like. I think they should name them. That's my opinion. So what's y'all's opinion? Leave it in the comment box below. Okay, guys, moving on once again. Um, we're at Thought Word of the Week. And we're on again, number 12. Oh boy. Okay. I hope I say this right. Now remember, when I first say this word, what's the first thing it made you think of? Laudable? I think I'm saying it right. Laudable or laudable? Ball, ball, laudable? Let me spell it for you. L A U D A B L E. <clears throat> and it means worthy of praise, commendable. That's what it means. Okay, leave your answer below in the comment box below about what that word when I first said it made you think of. Alright, and that ends our Tuesdays of the week video for this week. Thank y'all for watching. Leave all answers, comments, opinions, thoughts down below in the comment box below, like I've done said many, many, many times before. And did I say thank y'all for watching? I think I did. Hope you enjoyed it. Toodaloo till next time. Make sure I get it all said before I cut the camera off this time.